What is this? What? Hello guys and welcome back to Respawn Gaming. Today we're going to continue with the next episode of the Survivalists. And as you maybe remember from the last time we moved our base from the top side of this island to the bottom side of this island. Uh, so now we're actually at uh, well, the new base. Uh, we still miss the wall but that will be uh, done like in a couple of episodes. Um, I also color coded my monkeys so I now know which one are trained for specific tasks like the blue one is for crafting and the white ones are for hauling stuff. And as you guys maybe remember we were planning on going to the labyrinth at the bottom of the uh, rock island over here. Um, we I already made like a ton of weapons for them as you can see over here So we now have plenty of weapons. The only thing we will need now is the key So let's first get that one and after I got that one. I think we can just hop on the ship and go towards the, um, the Labyrinth and the key should be pretty close. It's uh, the balloon guy over here It appears it, it looked to me as if it was a bat on top of the labyrinth as symbol, so I'm hoping that's true. And, um, well, if that's true, uh, I'll need the bat key. So we're gonna buy that one. If that's not the case, then, well, we have to collect some more cash first. Hello, cat. So yeah, that was my cat entering the room. I don't know if you guys heard it, but... Uh... And let's have a look now. The bat key. The bat labyrinth key. This location can be found on the map, so gather your monkeys, prepare your supplies and call upon your friends to help the search for the richest rewards. Well, I'm definitely gonna do that. Let's have a check out what we can find over there. It does not appear in my... it's just some magical item that's now floating next right to me. Awesome. So let's go back to the base, hop on the ship, equip everyone with some weapons and well, let's have it a go. Maybe I'll take some more food first actually because I only have like seven at the moment. Okay guys, so here we're going. I got all my monkeys. I got my uh, a chest. For in the case we uh, encounter more stuff than I expected. I have like uh, an almost in empty inventory. And I got some of the... Okay, that's were just some turtles spitting at us. That's, uh, that's new for me. Um, I got the uh, spear. I got a bow. I actually learned that... I was expecting you have to shoot like each arrow once so you get to make like a ton of arrows and the arrows were pretty expensive apparently you just equip one bow with an arrow and then you can fire it as far as i know at the moment until it's like the uh the bar is empty uh, i picked up some extra meat kebab so i got plenty of food and well i guess as uh, I, I also took some uh an axe and a pickaxe to uh well, loot inside and then let's hope uh, I got enough stuff. I actually see now there's one monkey still holding metal. I think he will just uh, stay behind in that case. And uh, we'll go in with six monkeys. Because uh, with no weapon he's no use to us. And let's dock it in this corner. Perfect. And now follow, follow. Follow, you can stay behind, follow, follow, okay what did go wrong here, I have no weapons left, but I only got like three monkeys with weapons, follow and follow, you guys also have nothing, where did all your weapons go? Are you kidding me? There are only three monkeys. I mean, there was even one with a bow and arrow. What happened? Oh. 
Well, in that case, I'll go in with... Uh, oh, oh, wait, I know something I can do. Follow. Oh, wait, I already know what happened. No, that did not happen. I, yeah, I know what happened. I gave those monkeys weapons, but they were still on hauling, so they put all the weapons back into the crates. So I think I'll just go back for a second. Yeah, there are all the all the white ones have no weapons. Uh, I'll go back. I'll grab those weapons, and I'll see you guys back when I'm back up here with weapons this time. Okay, here we are again. Second try. It was indeed what I expected. They all just left their weapons behind um, in the crates. So I'm now going to go in for a second try. I got my weapons. I got their weapons. And they're all on follow. Let's see if we can open the labyrinth. We can. Are you guys ready? This is going to be it. Our first labyrinth guys it's gonna be awesome let's see what's inside okay this first room looks like any other where are my monkeys game aren't monkeys in loud in here or something hello are you guys coming with me or what Yeah, good job. Okay, I don't know what happened the first time. I would not have been... Oh, there are two doors. Well, let's have a look in here then. Don't see any pressure plates. That's another door. Okay, yeah, it's definitely a labyrinth. They got that right. Get them all, boys. Get them. Okay, well, that's one room unlocked or complete. Let's see if there's any reward in here for us. There are some spike traps. There are the bats. They're getting massacred. They're getting massacred pretty quick. Maybe I took too much monkeys. <laughs> I mean, it should still stay fair for them. Okay, well, that's this side of the labyrinth, I guess. Uh, let's collect that gold. And... I'm wondering if there are, like, secret rooms, too. That you can only find if you're, like... took my spare thank you and let's collect these two okay that's not not much but I mean there's still free goodies let's eat something I mean we have plenty of food and what's in here it's a pretty big room but it seems to be pretty empty too Oh, a bet. Well, you guys handle that one. I think we can make plenty of food um, after this uh, labyrinth. I mean, the amount of bat wings. I don't need to find a way to gather a lot of mangoes. Then we can make like the better type of food. Oh, this room is also completed. Can we do anything with the statue? That's a no. Okay, some wood only. Anything in the back? No, nothing here. So, in that case, this room also had no doors. I believe this room had a door to the side. Yes, it has. Let's go have a look in here. This one is pretty big. It seems like something is gonna spawn over here pretty soon, but... Maybe we killed that already? Hello? Anybody home? Okay, 
this really looks like a boss room or something. And then the last crates are up here. And then let's open this door and let's get those goblins that are behind it. Another room completed. Maybe I can even make a new... Uh, a new chest in here. With the amount of wood we got. Okay, that chest looks pretty awesome. And there are two other doors just opened. But maybe just bring this one first out. I mean, my inventory is also pretty full. Guys, get him, get him. He can do it. Good job. Okay, let's just get this chest first out. And um, let's empty our inventories. And then I'll meet you guys when I'm like back here. Okay, I'm back. We're back at this room. The chest was over here. And this room was empty. Yeah, it's empty. Let's go to the next room in that case. And then monkey's attack, I would say. Let's go get him. I'm actually thinking, I was just thinking, but I die, but then I'll get respawned at my bed. Can I build a bed on my boat? If that was is possible, that would be awesome. Thank you. Anything to loot in this room? Okay, it's pretty high. And we got multiple doors. Let's first go back here. Ow. Guys, why weren't you attacking? I thought I'll loot this body. But... Oh, and that's the end of this room. Then there's a room below this room. Let's see what this one will bring us. Open sesame. Okay, this is more like a loot room of the bears. Some planks. A drone. Warned you expired in 2000. Okay, so we're actually in the future? Or... Oh. Yeah, yeah, I think so. I mean, it doesn't mean we're like past 2817, but it does still mean we are like at least around 2800. That's pretty. Oh, <gasps> what? I picked up the, uh, what was it? A decorative a candle and at that moment I start okay this is pretty nice that I glow now not that it was too dark to see anything but still it's uh, pretty nice and then in this room guys goblin coming in get him imagine you're that goblin and you're just like getting harassed by eight monkeys at the same time I'm hoping actually there's like a clear end room or like a labyrinth completed message because like the other room with the golden chest I was actually thinking that was gonna be the last room but then apparently there are like multiple rooms which will contain chests and this room seems pretty empty then okay okay that yeah, this this is pretty clear Okay, okay, that's a boss. Come on guys, we almost got it. There we go. What's that? 
a new class crafting recipe okay I can I, I'm not gonna be able to see that at the moment relic Gain the key item. You have collected as the ship's wheel. This is an important item for escaping these islands. These items are tracked on the profile page of your journal. Ah, do you want to teleport back to them? Uh, no, not yet, not yet. I have a new trinket slot. Well, I just saw that not too long ago, but yeah. So we now have these two trinket slots. Thing is, I don't have any trinkets yet. And then we can loot in here, a quartz crystal and a metal frame. Well, if I may choose, wait, I can make a chest here, isn't it? Oh, no, I don't have rope now. Um, I can also can make rope, is it? I can't make rope at the moment. Also, no. And let's see what we can get out of here then. Let's first rescue our monkey so now we have eight that's pretty nice and then i guess i mean we have like three chests let's first open the two small ones okay that's a lot of gold i think we're actually kind of getting back to the amount of gold we had at the start um on the other hand we have the decision we can make I mean, we have, I think, only one room here left we can explore. Oh, and one up here. So I'm gonna grab this one, and this one will teleport us back to the entrance. So now we have two crates. I'm gonna empty my inventory. And then we have one other room, and that's down here. To the right, and back to the left, open sesame. And we have one more crate, so I'm actually quite happy we did this. How am I gonna cross this though? I mean, we cannot jump. Can you? Okay, that's possible. Nice, that's good to know. Anything in the back over here? Oh, another room. What is this? What? Is there like a way to get to the other side? It feels like one of those rooms where there is an invisible bridge. How would I be able to... I cannot like throw stuff... No. I would really like... I can check it like this. Is there an invisible bridge? Okay, no, it seems not to be one I would be able to walk. There are empty spots over here. Uh, one part of me is like try to, to jump into one of those holes and go to the other side. But at the same time, if I look at the map... It appears to be that there's here floor and over here there's nothing. So I'm not gonna risk it. So let's see. I cannot roll with this on my head. So I have to open this one over here. What do we get? Uh, lots of gold and a metal plating I can't pick up. Well, I don't need dirt. Who needs dirt? One more thing we have to do. And that's to open these two crates. Well, this one is... Not gonna be very special because this one is like one of the normal crates. So you need some glass, a pickaxe, and that's it. But then this one, this one is more golden than the others, and all the monkeys are watching. Let's see what we get. That's a ton of gold. A crafting recipe, and a sharp sword, and a gemstone. I can't even pick up this one. 
very rare touch gem with special properties. Well, I guess that's gonna be also for the magical stuff we just learned about. Um, but for now, I guess this is gonna be the end of this episode. Uh, next episode, we're first gonna clean up a little bit, and then I guess it's uh, well going to this island. Then let's see if we can find that labyrinth. We actually made a ton of money. I mean, we had like four and a half thousand uh, before we bought the key. Then we bought it for one and a half. So we earned like four thousand in that labyrinth. So I guess the next one, if it's gonna be the one that, that we need five thousand for, it's gonna be no problem. And if we earn some money from that one too, which I'm expecting, it should be no problem to enter the one after that. I mean, we have. 400 uh, gold we need more to enter the third labyrinth even so that's gonna be no problem and in that case i think there's only one thing left to say and that's uh, thank you guys for watching and uh, see you on the next one and remember gamers don't die they respawn